Hey guys. So today I'm gonna do an Alexa Chung inspired hair um, tutorial. At first, I was wanted to just dip dye my hair, which is a little bit different from ombre -ing it because ombre is a lot more hair dye than dip dyeing is just like the tips of your um, hair. But I decided, um, I was looking at pictures of like ombre short hair and I was looking at Alexa Chung's so I was like, hers is really hot. She always has short hair and she always rocks the ombre look and I was like, well, it looks good on her. I'm pretty sure it'll be okay on me. I went to my beauty supply store and um, I was recommended a hair dye. Um, I, I valued their opinions due to the fact that she's Asian and they have, obviously, you guys know that Asian people actually have dark hair. And she said her daughter used this brand all the time and never had to go and re, like, re try to dye it to get it blonde because this one didn't make her hair brassy or orange looking. So I trusted her and I got the brand. What I go for is the L'Oreal brand that is the L'Oreal for dark hair dye. I always do that because it's like semi not, um, like not really dyeing, like bleaching your hair. So like I said, um, the lady that was Asian uh, said that her daughter uses this um, brand right here for bleaching your hair to get lighter. Anyway, this is the one that she recommended to me. And um, this is what it looks like. I don't know what that says. I went to get the, the 30 extra lift so it will get really, really bright. So that's what I got. Um, and it's also by Clairol and yeah. So this is it, this is the one I got. So I'm gonna section off my hair and before I even do that stuff, I'm gonna section off my hair. So you guys see how my length of my hair is right now. Um, like so. So I'm kinda like looking at it and kinda seeing where I have it. And I want it evenly the same on each side. I look so stupid right now <laughs> make sure you measure it make sure you know like exactly where it's at it's going to be at the same level you want to make sure of that okay i know it's not supposed to be so neat because ombre effect is supposed to give like that very careless look and i love that so this um i'm just going to mix this stuff up and then i'm going to go in and start to um do my other stuff. I bought this Clairol package because I needed gloves and I said, hey, why not? You know, it comes with like a zip thing right here. It was only $1.99 and it came with this little brush, dyeing brush, but with the ombre effect, I don't feel like you don't really need this. So it came with this and a, um, some gloves. Hey guys, so it's only been about like 15 minutes and my hair is already light. So that stuff is really good. Uh, right now it looks a bit crazy because I halfway, um, I halfway washed it out, which I had to wash this side out because now it's starting to look crazy. But um, that stuff works really fast and really good. Um, I didn't think that it was going to dye my hair that fast, but it really, really did. So now I'm going to go wash it off. I just want you guys to see what it looked like beforehand. And yeah, that's really it. I just wanted to show you guys what it looked like before I wash it out. And I'm going to go wash it and I'll show you guys any product with it being uh, washed and um, fixed up and stuff. So, so um, this is the ending product. I feel like when I, on camera it looks red for some reason. But it's not red. It's like a... Um, really light brown um in the back it's blonde because um like i showed you guys in my video where i was doing like um how i get my hair straightened and stuff um i showed you guys that it was lighter in the back because i had dyed my hair like a different color in the back in the summertime of last year and then i dyed it back black it was like a dark brown so that's why this came out a lot more brighter and you know and this is how it looks all around. I don't know.
But this is how it looks. I'll get a little bit closer. Um, I kind of want to re-dye my bang black because I don't like that just being like that color. I don't like it too much. Um, but yeah.